CBN wheels at high RPM are widely used in sharpening woodworking tools, but not as much for knives. These are trial wheels of our new product for knife sharpening. We call them dual feed CBN wheel. They are 250 millimeters in diameter and feed both common grinders and any slow bed grinder that takes 250 millimeter wheel and has a 12 millimeter shaft. Tormac, Shepach, Jet, Racket, Triton, Van, Holtzman, Grizzly, you name it. I designed them as dual function. We run them on slow tomic for precise sharpening of high-end knives and folders, while in commercial sharpening of kitchen and butcher knives, we run them on grinders at higher RPM. At the moment, these wheels are on trial in knife sharpening. As part of the trial, we estimate heating by them. In this test, I do it on the half-speed grinder because this is what we use ourselves and recommend. Our low-speed grinders run at 1425 RPM. In other words, half the regular speed. But we, of course, will test full speed as well. We start our test with the CBN wheel grid 80. The grid 80 CBN wheel grinds extremely fast. If I give the knife 8 passes on it, it will grind away the edge with all the lacquers. We therefore will test heating in a practical task of reprofiling edge from 20 to 12 dps. Knife in this test has 20 degrees per side initially. I will do as many passes as needed to grind one side of the edge down to 12 degrees. I will stop as soon as I raise the bar and we will estimate heating by the temperature lacquers on the other side of the blade. We've got the burr in two passes, so we need only two passes to reprofile the edge from 20 degrees to 12 degrees per side. This is of course good news, but the temperature lacquers tell us a different story and this story is far from good. The upper lacquer blew off in grinding. However, we clearly see that the temperature has risen to 232 Celsius for 150 Fahrenheit. We also see discoloration on the edge and at the very tip, in the thinnest parts of the blade. A new knife, the same test, grinding from 20 down to 12 degrees, but now with the honing cooler.
Yeah, I've raised the bird. And as we can see, none of the lacquers triggered. Telling us that temperature in the edge has not gone over 150 Celsius, 300 Fahrenheit. The honing coolant indeed does its job well. The grid 80 CBN will be used for reprofiling to a lower angle, thinning worn blades and removing large chips. Next test is Xibian wheel grid 400 run at low speed with the honing coolant. Based on the experience with the grid 80, I wouldn't dare sharpen knives on CBN wheel without honing coolant. Low speed. Changes after four passes. The next test is the most challenging in sense of heating. This knife edge is 10 degrees per side. The CBN grid is extra fine, grid 1000. The grinder speed is full. We will do four passes and estimate the heating. But first, I will apply the coolant. Full speed. None of the lacquers have triggered, no overheating at all. For the protocol, we have not tested wheels of other material, like steel or nylon. Our CBN wheels have a massive 2.2 kg aluminium body that dissipates heat very well and, together with our honing coolant, prevents overheating. Things are usually a trade-off between cheaper, faster and better. Usually we can have any two of those at the expense of the third. But these dual fit CBN wheels win all three. They are cheaper than regular CBN or diamond wheels for Tomic. They work much faster when they run on a common grinder. And thanks to the heat dissipation and our honing coolant, we can run them dry getting edges of the same quality and retention as what we get on the slow and wet turmeric. When we need to grind with high precision, we simply remount them from grinders on turmeric. Direction of rotation. 
At high RPM, work with the wheel rotation to prolong the CBN wheel lifespan. On slow bed grinders, like Tromic, direction of rotation does not affect the lifespan and we grind chiefly into the wheel as this creates a smaller burr. Nowadays, in our workshop, we sharpen common knives on our CBN wheels run on a half-speed grinder with the honing coolant. While folding knives we do on the same CBN wheels but run on Tromic. High-end kitchen knives we reprofile to a lower angle on our CBN wheels run on a grinder and complete grinding on Tromic. Grinding angle on grinders is controlled with our software Angle Setter for Badge Grinder. Sharpening knives on CBN wheels run on a grinder significantly shortens sharpening time and increases turnover. Takes under one minute per knife. Sharpening for commercial kitchens we use a pair of CBN wheels grid 160 and grid 400. At the moment we are the only on the planet making 250mm CBN wheel for grinders that can also be run on Tromek and similar slow grinders. I need more time for trials before we release these wheels to public. I am determining the embedding rate, how deep the CBN crystals must sit in the bed that works best for both the common grinders and slow turmeric. For these I need to sharpen 4-5 thousand knives on them and estimate the wear. If you want them, either on your grinder or your turmeric or both or your shepach or else, please check our website in December. I think we should be able to open sale in December. But if the Christmas and New Year break delays production of the first batch, then you will get them in January. In closure, I want to say that CBN wheels are the single biggest advance in sharpening in a very long time.